Today, we'll guide you through changing the wand assembly on both the DR58 and DR82 models. Before you begin, ensure you have the correct replacement wand assembly. Part number RFW58 for the DR58 or RFW82 for the DR82. You'll also need a Phillips head screwdriver. Note, you'll be reusing the original screws, so keep those handy. Start by making sure your leak detector is powered off. Flip the unit over so the back is facing up. Locate the three screws at the top of the back panel. Using your Phillips head screwdriver, remove each screw, taking care not to lose the small seals on them. These seals are important and should be reused during reassembly. Once the screws are removed, lift off the old wand assembly. If you have a DR58, this is a good opportunity to replace the heated diode sensor if needed. Simply pull out the old sensor and insert the new one, part number RHD1, into the pinholes. The sensor can be inserted in either orientation, so pin alignment is not an issue. Avoid pressing on the top as this may cause contamination or excessive pressure that could damage the top cover or membrane. Grip the sensor by the sides and press gently to insert. For DR82 users, there is no sensor to replace. The DR82 uses a 10-year infrared sensor, which is not field replaceable. Next, take your new wand assembly, RFW58 for the DR58 or RFW82 for the DR82, and carefully align it on the back of the device. Reinsert the three screws, making sure the seals are in place, and tighten them securely. Power on your leak detector. If there are no warning messages or warm-up errors and the unit starts up normally, you've successfully replaced your field piece leak detector's wand assembly. Regular maintenance ensures your tools perform at their best. Thanks for watching and happy detecting.